Hello everyone and welcome back to Guild Wars 2. Today we're not doing a specific mission. We have to complete our first New Hawk Mastery before we can continue on into the Lost Assurance City. So this is basically just me running around. Um, I did a lot of map discovery um, and just trying to get map completion, at least everything discovered, not necessarily like um, points of interest or vistas unless I stumbled across a point of interest and then I got it at that point. Um, I was trying to find waypoints. There doesn't seem really to be a whole lot of waypoints on this map. Um, they're pretty far spread out and kind of a problem because I kept dying frequently. This, this map, the tangled depths are just littered, littered with bad guys everywhere. And it's never just like one or two, like you think there's one or two and then all of a sudden you've got like three or four. So I will admit for a good majority of this map I just I use my little stealth heal and I use my quick feet my speed up and I just I zoom through the map because I just I couldn't <laughs> it's just it's too many things like I'm like I can take on just about any monster 1v1 um minus like bosses obviously but like when it starts getting swarmy, it's very difficult for my character to handle that. Um, like the little guys, like wasps, aren't usually too bad, but this map has a lot of like the chalk type of um, characters, and the mushrooms are around quite frequently, and it just it gets a lot. <laughs> Um, so I tried to do this one event with somebody and it didn't quite go the right way. I was just exploring and I stumbled into this event, but it was just one person doing it. So it didn't end up being, I mean, it was doable, but it was just beat up all these things, beat up all these things, beat up some more things, like, which is just monotonous. <laughs> um, so... I did this for a little while and then I died and I went back to the waypoint because I still only had one waypoint discovered at this point. So uh, I went back and then I was kind of just all over the place. Um, eventually I just, I start following the roads around. <laughs> I was just like, you know what? Fine. We'll just follow the road and we will not worry about it. We'll just follow the road, zoom around stop attacking all of this random shenanigans that are around because there's random shenanigans everywhere and it's like it's hard it's so hard to tell like what's a dead end what's a cave like the tangled depths are tangled like it is ridiculous you're underground you're above ground you're like you're at the bottom of the forest essentially but it's it's ridiculous so I try to just glide around and not really pay attention to it, but you can see here I'm just kind of done with trying to fight things. It's like, well, how about I just bounce? <laughs> how about I just see y'all later? Just fly away. Just fly away. Goodbye. So yeah, I stumbled into like getting an event reward there, and I was like, all right, cool. Sure, why not? Um, and that's pretty much how I get my mastery is that I end up stumbling into a meta event and I just I end up kind of just tagging along enough to get a ton of experience for it and it's like all right cool like that seems to be how I get the majority of things at this point is I just stumble into it and dumb luck <laughs> Who needs skill? Who needs skill when you've got dumb luck, right? So, uh, yeah, it's literally just me running around the map doing stuff. Nothing super special. Um, 
It's a, like I said, it's a very interesting map. Um, so yeah, we did eventually do it. The next video is probably going to be a little choppy because I started that mission, not like totally forgetting to <laughs> restart it. So, um, I had to cut part of this recording and put it into the next video and so it's going to be a little ridiculous, but that's okay. You might not even notice. Depends on how I decide to put it together. Um, but yeah, it was, like I said, this just ended up being an hour of me running around doing stuff. Nothing really super special. And it's insane how many experience points you get for doing, like, the big meta, I guess, type events on the map. So, um, I finally was like, all right, let's see the scout. Let's see what the scout has to say. How big is this area? And I was like, oh, damn it. <laughs> so this is when I was like, and we're following the map. This, this, we're, we're just following the map. And I was trying to decide which way I wanted to go and I zoomed in and I was like, let's follow the road. Sometimes I forget you can zoom in. And here I was just like, no, no, I'm not fighting any of you. No, I don't want to do it. So long. Goodbye. Have a fun trip. <laughs> I don't want to play with you. It's just, like I said, so many, so many random bad guys just all over littered this map. It was ridiculous. There's a couple points I went into and I was just like, are you shitting me right now? Like, you walk through and it's like insane. It's insane. How many? Like this part right here. It's like, let me just stroll through Chalk Forest. Like, no problem there. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. What? Like, there's just chalk everywhere. Everywhere. And it's just insane. It's insane. And like I said, I just literally, I was done at this point with fighting shit. And I just, I was looking for the different waypoints. I was looking for the different parts of the map. I was looking to see if there was a group of people doing a event at all just to see because often with like the bigger events like people know like the timing and stuff of it it's crazy and they'll be like all right we're starting this up and like but because I didn't have anything discovered I couldn't just like waypoint into an event like I had to like go explore it so it was it's rough, so I was like, all right, well, exploring the different areas, you know, gives you a little bit of it. But because I didn't know the map, I didn't know what the acronyms people were saying, and I didn't know, like, the different references they were making. Now, I will say, as soon as I stumbled onto <laughs> this area, I was like, all right, this is clearly where everybody is right now. Like, I need to figure out how to, but I can't fly. Like, so you see that one dude was off going to fly and I'm like, I can't just sail my merry way over there. Like, I gotta walk it, <laughs> gotta hoof it. And I've got no idea how to do that. So uh, off I go. And it's like, well, this isn't quite the right area maybe. And I was like, well, and I was going to glide across and I failed. So I was like, and we're going to go see what's down here. I'm like, oh, literally stumbled into it. Like literally just free foul my way into this event. Like no idea what I was doing. No idea what I was getting myself into. No idea. <laughs> I was like, all right, what if I just uh, not be in the middle of it? And that's the hard part is like, 
with my character, if I just go eat myself into the middle of a bad guy, especially a boss like this, like it's just it's not gonna end well. So it's kind of just on the outskirts of the event, just trying to pick little shit off so the you know badass characters could do what they needed to do. I'm like, listen, I'll take pot shots of things and like. I'll go knife some of the smaller stuff, but like, I can't. <laughs> and like, I know obviously it would be helpful, but like dying all of the time is not helpful. So I just pretty much, when I try to just join a random event like this, I try to just hang back and stay alive and just hit what I can when I can and resurrect people. Like, I pretty much just try to circle around and resurrect other people because I'm like, you're going to do more help than me. <laughs> but yeah, then I was like, oh, okay, cool. Like, got a sh ton of experience for that event. Awesome. And then I had a little bit of the chalk acid or whatever you needed to open it up. So I did some of those nowhere near enough of what I needed. But then, like, the event completionist, like, the meta event thing, like, I ended up doing 75% of it. So, I got a ton of experience for that. And then, all of a sudden, I was back to this part. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. Like, I know where I am now. <clears throat> and I was like, let's go discover Radanovis. So, later in life, I'm not... <laughs> struggle busting and again there's just chalk everywhere and with how my character is like if I yeet myself the wrong direction or if I accidentally target something that I don't want to target I'm screwed <laughs> it's just a pain in the butt sometimes um I mean it is what it is so then I was like all right well I'll go down and I will explore more off of the ley line connecting thing. This person was AFK, so I was like, okay, let's just resurrect you for funsies. And then I'm not sure what this group of people were doing. Um, yeah, I really don't know what they were doing. But then the map meta event thing popped up and I was like, oh, <laughs> all right, cool. And. I could do that, and then I was like, oh, let's go do... Let's go do it. We're getting ready. We're going. And then I was like, oh, I don't have a waypoint over there. <laughs> it's super far. So the last part of this video is just resetting back to the um, instance marker. Which is not really an instance, it's just a talk to the guy and he talks to you and tells you what you need to do. So, yeah. It's just, that's what it was, but we got our mastery point, so that's all that matters. Right? <laughs> doesn't matter how we got there, doesn't matter if we stumbled into it by dumb luck, we got there. Um, so yeah, I'll leave you guys here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye guys.